Uh, you will get more and more chest out of this fight uh, you will have a fight of two minutes if you do survive obviously you're going to get more and more chest you will end up in some fights depending on the mode that you're going to pick go for night the normal one it's decent enough. if you are stuck in a campaign mode don't forget to use vanquish and that's how you're going to consume all the rum you're going to collect all the rewards and after just go offline welcome reach out damien saga chrono pirates an idol rpg over here on idol games tv now you're going to be able to collect your offline loot obviously you're going to get a lot a lot of gear a lot a lot of fragments and you're going to be able to summon more and more heroes the idea would be that you're going to go into the adventure different kind of campaign stages eventually you're going to be able to unlock more and more features in this game as further as you go you're going to hit prepare over here in order for you to assemble the best best team you're going to send in the fight up to five heroes you're going to have different kind of rarities for them uh, you know the idea ssr ones rare ones and so on uh, you're going to have different kind of formation lineups over here different kind of effects for each one you can level these things up increase those bonuses over there you can hit auto mode the game will automatically place the best heroes that he can send in the battle and if you're going to click auto battle it will go automatically forward forward as long as you're going to be able to win you can farm the same stage again and again if you do desire to do that in order for you to consume that you will uh, basically swipe that stage with uh, all the resources does it have if you cannot pass from the campaign uh, that's what you're going to want to do in order for you to consume the energy points that you have now this is a boss fight every five levels or so depending on the on the campaign stage honestly uh, you're going to encounter this boss uh, option over here uh, you do need to get those three stars in order for you to get those three stars everybody needs to survive the fight uh, some of the heroes that you're going to be able to send in the fight are not going to be the ones that you have uh, leveled up so you're going to be able to borrow the level from the weakest top five heroes that you have you're going to mirror their level in a way here it is everybody survive i got three stars right now the game will automatically send me towards the next stage here it is in the next five seconds this is what you're going to want to do i'm going to hit exit uh, yes i almost got into the next fight here it is uh, vanquish this is what you're going to want to do in order for you to consume the rom that's what you're going to consume over here in this game the energy because you're a pirate over here come on now you're going to have the crew option over here and in the crew you're going to have achievements you're going to have ascension this is where you're going to be able to ascend your heroes quick ascension in order for you to uh, quick ascend some of the heroes over here you're going to be able to link uh, the heroes in order for you to uh, let's say borrow the level over here we're going to need to collect the resources uh, from that uh, option over there it is i'm going to place this one it is level 140 and don't forget to equip those heroes although you place them over here don't forget to equip them also you're going to have the chronicles you're going to be able to dismiss some of the heroes that you do not want this is where you're going to be able to reset your hero in the dismiss option okay don't forget about this option and team composition uh, you're going to be able to level up over here this is what i meant you're going to be able to upgrade balance blitz depending on what kind of strategy you will use over here and obviously depending on what kind of heroes will you get now you're going to be able to have the hero option over here these are going to be uh, the heroes that you have collected over here the, the heroes are going to be able to be geared up and also you're going to be able to attach towards them a specific portrait a specific card over here now if you're going to have the option to place this card you're going to offer them additional bonuses uh, attack hp physical defense depending on the rarity of the card that you're able to place over here okay now you can check out the skills for a specific hero uh, hero you're going to have eventually most likely different kind of skins story and you're going to have the talent option over here and depending where you're going to farm in those dungeons uh, you're going to be able to level up specific skills for uh, some of the heroes that you're going to have now in the union is the guild over here that you're going to have you're going to have a boss that you do need to challenge daily in order for you to uh, be able to get more and more rewards you're going to get a lot a lot of equipment out of this uh, hero the first start you, the first battle sorry you do need to play it the second one you can just sweep it it's going to be a quick battle option uh, over here if you're going to send the best team obviously you're going to do more and more damage try to send automatically the best team uh, you will get more and more chests out of this fight uh, you will have a fight of two minutes if you do survive obviously you're going to get more and more chests it depends on how much are you going to survive eventually at the start you are going to die over here because it's hard enough 
but this is the best place for you to get gear at least at first so try to farm in an active union uh, in order for you to get in more and more resources out of those uh, uh, let's say uh, activation rewards from the union okay now keep in mind this is an idle rpg so for sure give this game a try if you're a fan of those idle rpgs and also subscribe to the channel if you're not yet subscribed because daily i will post over here a new idle game and for sure more and more idle games uh, and idle rpgs to come because i'm quite quite a fan of those idle rpgs now if you have played this one and went further drop us also a comment let us know your tips your thoughts regarding this game and what are the best heroes over here uh, for sure didn't yet figure out the things but you do have a specific uh, let's say uh, ranking system for each hero so everybody can vote depending on how much does he like a specific hero so you can guide towards that thing in order for you to figure out which are the best ones who are the worst ones at least at first afterwards you're going to figure out that you're going to need tanks healers and so on so believe me uh, you're going to figure out it's not that hard uh, you're going to have different kind of dungeons also you're going to have different kind of map fragments that you need to collect different kind of fights i'm going to show you in a bit after i'm going to die over here there it is let's see if i'm able to collect up to 50 chests out of this boss but most likely no because i ended up with only three hero okay 50 for me good good for me and uh, 30 more seconds to go let's see if i'm going to hit exit if i'm going to still get the rewards Come on, let's see. No, ah, oh, come on. Okay, I thought that I was going to get the rewards, but here it is. Depending on uh, how much damage will you do, you're going to get different kinds of rewards. Don't worry, the idea will be the same every day if you're going to jump into this uh, into this union fight. Now, in the field option, this is where we're going to have the dungeons, the tower of trial, the endless tower that you have uh, for uh, each of those. Uh, either rpgs eventually you're going to have towers for each specific faction you do need to play in the campaign further and further uh, depending on how much did you play you're going to have the pirate dice i uh, just hit it on auto mode and it will go forward and forward give you some rewards you will end up in some fights depending on the mode that you're going to pick go for knight the normal one it's decent enough and you will get all the rewards the hard one it's hard believe me you'll not finish it the arena this is where you're going to be able to fight with all the players the fractured knight over here now this is where you're going to be able to get more and more gold coins and honestly more and more dust that you're going to need this is a really really important uh, thing that you're going to need to be able to upgrade your main hero so don't forget about this one daily you will have daily two tickets over here in order for you to get more and more rewards and the expedition this is where you're going to send your heroes in different kind of missions uh, in order for them to bring you more and more rewards out of this game not that hard, you're going to have the daily quest that you need to complete over here. Uh, if you're going to be able to complete them, you're going to get more and more rewards out of it, more and more fragments. Uh, the fragments do apply even for the cards that you're going to be able to place on your main hero. Uh, here it is, you're going to have the fame quest. Now, if you're going to accept this quest, you're going to need to complete that specific task, okay? That's going to be the main, main focus over here. Uh, you do want to watch out what you're going to accept over here in order for you to uh, complete them you're going to be able to accept up to seven fame quests uh, and that's how you're going to be able to get the rewards you're going to have free rewards over here now if you're going to click this option you're going to be able to watch these ads daily watch them because they're going to offer you more and more loot you're going to go into the storage option over here and you're going to have this chest that you do want to use in order for you to be able to uh, max up all all the heroes uh, you will get eventually stuck because you do not have your heroes uh, let's say start up that much in order for you to be able to progress further a lot a lot of emails that you're going to be able to uh, get uh, rewards out of and keep in mind that you're going to have a quick battle over here as well different kind of events right now there's an event with the uh, the the cannon ended and right now, now right now there's a different event so every day every week at least a new a new event give this game a try really really nice for sure it's really really impressive until next time take care don't forget to subscribe if you are stuck in a campaign mode don't forget to use vanquish and that's how you're going to consume all the rum you're going to collect all the rewards and afterwards just go offline and the game will do its thing collect all the offline income because it's an idle rpg Guys, give this game a try. If you had, let me know in the comments below. Take care. Bye.